Hi, this is Christian Babolinski, and this is going to be a tutorial on how to set up your project with Gaze version 2. I just used the demo project provided in the asset pack, and I took away the VR event system, so now when I click play, the buttons aren't interactable. So let's fix that. We're going to do that by adding a the VR event system to the main camera, and that script's located under script in the Gaze control folder. After I add it, I can start interacting with my objects. So what's new in version 2? Well, we added a scale option in, right in the script so you can scale the cursor as you need it. We also added animations for the, for the auto click. You have a radial, a radial simple, which is just a faster radial than in the simple animation, which was included in the version 1 of Gaze. And then we have a shrink, which uses a crosshair to spin around and then shrink down to simulate the button click. What you also can see about the new crosshair is that when you interact with objects, it actually gets positioned to the position of the objects. It also grows slightly so that you can see that it's on top of something that you can interact with. We also namespace the script. So now you can use the script with the standard assets without having any difficulties. You just have to declare using gaze input at the top of your script. In the script, we also included uh, magnetic support for the cardboard version one. And that support can be added by following instructions on the documentation by just uncommenting a line of code in the start function. What's also new in version two that the system adds a VR interactable component to game objects even when they're inactive at start. So for this instance, I took away this pan this whole section of the demo scene, but as soon as I activate it, then you can start interacting with it uh, even though it was turned off on start. That's it for this version of Gaze. You can send your request using the contact form on our website and make sure you sign up for beta so you can try out these features as they become available.